Hello and welcome to the Babes Monthly Digest. This is our video update about the awesome things that have been happening on the Babes platform in September. And we will start with development news. After three months of wrestling smart contracts into shape on testnet, we have finally unleashed them on mainnet. The update was enthusiastically endorsed by miners. We have also published several articles and tutorials explaining how you can use them and how to create your first wave smart contract. Take a look at the link to find out more. Our updated ride ID looks great, supports more commands in the console, and it's ready for next big step forward. We'd love it if you send us your feedback about use cases and vision for ID development. Check out the link below and join the discussion on the forum. The community node program for miners has been running for two weeks now and has delivered incredible results. We've had over 50 applications and the total number of global waves nodes is now over 300. A very big thank you to all new node owners. And finally, Waves community has the opportunity to decide which coin will be listed next on DEX, thanks to the vaulting tool implemented on the Waves blockchain. Anyone can take part, but you'll need some Waves community tokens to cast your vote. This voting platform is actually the realization of the transparent and reliable voting process that everybody wants. Banco won the first voting round and will be listing BNT on DEX in due course. Check the link below to find out more about the voting process. And now it's time for our product news from Dmitry. Our team has released a new version of Waves client with Ledger support, so now working with Waves is completely secure. Check out the blog post for details about this integration. We have added the sponsored transactions feature. This enables users of your token to pay the transaction fees in the token instead of Waves, while miners are compensated from your balance. So now, your users don't need to have Waves in their accounts to transfer funds and miners always get compensated fairly. Waves desktop application now supports authentication for third-party web resources. Any transaction for a Waves integrated site can be handled through the desktop app without typing your seed or password, so it's totally safe. We've had a really busy month with lots of community activity. You'll find a full report on our community portal, links in the description below. One of the highlights is the grant program we launched for important and interesting projects in the Waves ecosystem. We want to support great developers, so if you have a working project or idea, follow the link to the topic on the forum. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it and leave a comment with your feedback. Thanks for watching and see you next month.